Hi, beauties and curls. It's Melissa Q. Welcome back. If you're new, I just want to welcome you and say what's up. Hope you hit the subscribe button while you're here and don't forget to hit the notification bell. It's going to let you know that I post videos every Tuesday, Friday, and Sunday. Thanks. Yeah, it's Texture Tuesday and I'm, I'm so excited because you guys helped me actually curate this video. I saw, I think there's a video that's going around about the $20 curly hair challenge where everything that I put in my head, everything for a curly routine has to be under 20 so I'm gonna put prices down below but I promise you this is under 20 dolores okay so let's just jump right in so the first item that I have for you is the L'Oreal ever curl it is sulfate free it is their hydro charge cleansing conditioner now like how can that be in the under under 20 because I only paid a dollar ninety nine. Yes, I got this from my ninety nine cent store, and I got a couple of them. So don't sleep. Stay woke, y'all. Don't sleep on. I don't know why. Well, stay woke. I am awake. Don't sleep on the L'Oreal Ever Curl Sulfate Free Curl Care System. This is from L'Oreal. It is. It was a dollar ninety nine at my ninety nine cent store. Y'all don't sleep on the ninety nine cent store. Go into the beauty section. Yes, find out when they ship or when shipments come, sometimes they're daily, but there's some stores that come like once a week. If you find out the date of that week, be there and you'll get the best of the best items. I know I'm just telling y'all one of my secrets. Okay, one of my shopping secrets. But anyway, this was $1.99. I really enjoyed this. It's non-drying anti-frizz system and it has natural botanicals. I like it because it is very hydrating to my hair, and although it has a low foam, it's really, really good. They also have the cleansing balm. That one's like $6.99, but because we are doing the under $20 curly routine challenge, this is what I picked. So that's what I'm going to wash my hair with. Okay, so you guys know that I do the LCO method. So after washing out my hair, the first thing that I go in on soaking wet hair is an oil. This one I found, this one is from Maui Moisture. Now I am in love with this. It is a heal and hydrate plus shea butter raw oil. It has shea butter, coconut oil, and macadamia oil. It is silicone free and it smells so good. Y'all can tell uh, by how much I've used, but I put this on soaking wet hair. Um, this is my new favorite oil from the drugstore. Yes, I love it. Now I can use pure coconut oil, but I feel like that this one actually hydrates my hair a little bit longer because it locks in that moisture, but I really do like it and it's super light. I'm gonna show you guys and you can use this on wet or dry hair and it just gives a nice sheen to the hand. If y'all see, it smells so good. Like I would use this on my body. It is so good. Okay, let me find it. Oh, it's just, and it leaves that shine, you know? So I really do enjoy that. <sighs> this brand I've learned, it's been on sale a couple of times at Ulta. So I saw this also at CVS. It always has like the buy one, get one half off or two for amount of you know a certain amount of money well this one was two for fourteen dollars so that's how i was able to do the curly girl challenge it's a challenge y'all so you definitely have to get these on sale because they're like $7.99 $8.99 by themselves but if you get the deal like i did right here it was two for fourteen so i'm already at sixteen dollars and let me tell you this is the challenge right I use this as my leave-in and I can use this as my deep conditioner. I love this because it is glycerin free. Hallelujah. <laughs> this is the Heal and Hydrate Shea Butter Hair Mask and it softens, quenches, and repairs. And it tells you you can even use it as a leave-in. I am so excited. I looked at the ingredients. Y'all tell me if I'm wrong, but I did not see glycerin and my hair can tell the difference, y'all. I have been killing this. It is so, so good. Of course, I've already done the review for these. I've done the review for these because I'm going to do it right, like right now. But this is so good. I use this as my deep conditioner and I use this as my leave-in. So, absolutely love this. Yes. Huh. Yes. A two, for, a two for one. You got to have that in a challenge, right? 
So I did not forget deep conditioner. So I'm actually doing five functions in this challenge. I'm so excited. So now that I have my leave in, now I'm going in for my styler and y'all know what my styler is. Y'all know. And this one, I am going to use my Eco Styler Olive Oil. I love this one because this one is a multifunctional one. This one is great on my hair. It is really good for your edges. It was $1.49. The great thing about this is even though I have the large tubs, which would still be under the price, the great thing I wanted to show you this size is because you can still get a smaller size. This size is actually great for travel, and I wanted to show you all this because this is actually my traveling gel, but absolutely love Eco Styler Gel. I know it contains glycerin, but this still works on my hair, especially for slicking back my hair it's great for protective styling because when you want to put it in buns and everything it's still going to slick down those edges i really do enjoy this it's a maximum of 10 and i've just completed the challenge yes so this is my curly girl 20 dollars challenge i beat the price i'm so glad Thanks so much. Let me know if you are in for the Curly Girl Challenge and list the products down below that you have in your cabinet, in your cupboard, that is under the $20 challenge. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up and check out the iCards over here and let me know what you want to see next here on the channel. Thanks so much. I'll talk to you soon.